Hey YouTube, in my last video, I put together a ghost platform running on DigitalOcean in a Docker container with Let's Encrypt. Uh, one of the things I don't like about the Casper theme is um, it's really dark and kind of harsh. So what I did is change some of the CSS instead of having it look like the original black and the gray theme looks like this, which is a little less harsh. So it's like a blue color. And actually, I got the blue color from, uh, I think it was my Twitter account. It was the background. And so I just used this, uh, you know, color pick eyedropper. And then it you just do like that. And you can't see it, but uh, it, it shows you the... Um, hexadecimal code. Anyway, I wanted to let you know that I put the uh, I put the CSS on my GitHub account and it's uh, right there. And so if you scroll down, then I'll leave a link in the description also. So if you scroll down, you're going to see what you have to put into code injection. That's all the CSS there. So you just, you know, copy it. And then I'll go over here and just show you. I've already done it, so I just go ahead and show you on code injection what it looks like. And that's the color code there. So you can you can just change that and have a different, you know, different uh, color code, you know, lighter, darker, green, yellow, whatever. Um, I'll show you what it looks like here. Anyway, so you can just test that out. And then if you happen to like whatever you come up with, you can go here back to my GitHub and you can add Site Search 360, show you how to do that. You know, edit line 17 and index.hbs just under class uh, equals site description. And then you can add it or remove it here. And then you put this in default HBS. Now, if you want to clone the repository and just make all the changes yourself, and then and then uh, you can do that here. You got to install yarn, and it give you the commands here. Gulp. In any case, uh, I wanted to do a quick video let you know you can change this. So, thank you very much for listening. And I do hope this helps somebody.